York City, the Big Apple. And this place has seen a lot of troubles in the last few years, with crime waves, subway strikes, and near bankruptcy. And a lot of people feel that if any city needs a fairy godmother, this is the one. Well, New Yorkers, somewhere in this crowd of businessmen and lawyers lies the answer to your prayers. He's a normal stockbroker by day, but when the mood strikes him, he becomes something else. Meet Rollerina. Now, this may not be your idea of a fairy godmother, but at the end of a hard day, New Yorkers are grateful for any blessings they can get. Even if the magic wand is from Woolworths, and even if the fairy godmother may be a fairy godfather. She needs a shave. Is it a fairy godmother? Is that what it is? This is a blessing for your stocks to go up. I chatted with Rollerina in her apartment. Or was it his apartment? Rollerina had me a little confused. There's a he and a she here. Can we get that straight? I'm, I'm the same person, but I live two lives the nine to five, and then being America's number one roller skating queen when I'm Rollerina. But Rollerina isn't Rollerina 24 hours a day. I have my other career. Which I is? Working on Wall Street, being a homemaker. I didn't spring Rollerina on New York City overnight. It, was, it developed. I added, Rollerina added earrings, a, a, a ring, a corsage, to make that a more complete look. I took a little skate with Rollerina through the park, and I'll tell you, New York isn't the easiest place to be a fairy godmother. For every person who wants to be blessed, there's one who runs away, and another one who just as soon run you over. Watch that. After touring the park, we skated downtown, where Rollerina gave us a little demonstration. Rollerina, show me some of your disco technique. Okay, you go. <laughs> Rollerina came to New York 10 years ago, a Vietnam veteran from Gravel Snatch, Kentucky. And people wonder why parents worry when their children move to New York City. This is Peggy Fleming. Peggy Fleming? <laughs> Even a fairy godmother needs a night off. And at Manhattan's Roxy Roller Disco, Rollerina can let it all hang out. Now, I'm not saying Roll Arena wasn't a fun date, but she was a bit on the wild side for me. So while Roll Arena was busy getting down, I was busy trying to get out. What is Roll Arena's mission? I protected the American people from the threat of communism. I should have the right to spread peace, love, joy, and happiness everywhere Roll Arena rolls.